and welcome to Space Engineers on the Xbox on my Series X with a mod showcase and this is an impromptu one because SE Modder 4 spotted this one earlier in the week pointed it out to me and I thought oh I'm going to have to show this one off what is it? Let's get right into this one it's Zat's Kitchen great for people who want to build uh, kitchen areas, mess areas in their ships and on their headquarters and it also covers a small grid version as well so let's have a quick look at that if we come over here to my little small grid bit and we'll throw it in it's in the mod section obviously and you'll find a dedicated small grid and you'll see it's got the small grid symbol if you look at your menu at kitchen counter at the top there you'll see a little white square with a black dot in the left hand lower corner that's small grid indicator so what have we got we've got the kitchen counter we have oops, excuse me there we go we have the kitchen counter with a top shelf a corner kitchen counter kitchen counter corner with a top shelf a kitchen sink and one with a top shelf and an oven and one with a hood and a bin so there you go that's your small grid moving on moving on as they say this is the large grid stuff and we look at it individually here we have kitchen counter left See, we've got the left, we've got the right, we've got one with top shelves left, we've got one with top shelves right. We have kitchen counters and we have kitchen counters with top shelves. We have some corners with top shelves and regular. We have some fridges. And all these are left and right with inverted so you can get your uh, headquarters mess hall looking just right. I may go through the Callisto 71 with this and uh, change my mess hall. Now uh, we've got access to this. That's pretty cool. Kitchen ovens. Kitchen sinks. See the various ones. I'm just letting you flip through. I'll show you these in a second. We've got some mess hall tables, some regular tables. We've got some bins and then back round to our small grid kitchen counters. What we have over here are our tables and rather than messing around trying to create a table we've got one and the pose as you enter the table is different for this pose two table as it is for this pose one table it is another nice little touch then here's some of the units i've placed down that's a refrigeration unit you can actually connect this up to a conveyor system on this one so your refrigeration unit can actually be used from a base conveyor then we've got again more storage with the fridges perfect if you're running a mod as well uh, on a, a dedicated server um, that has food and drink if there's one available if not well maybe there will be down the line it's still cool nice to see that these aren't just decorative they actually have 3,375 litres of storage moving along to the various kitchen counter tops top shelves kitchen counters themselves left kitchen counters more kitchen counters your ovens and these have got a uh, level of detail construction to them as well everything is spot on uh, I can't fault this mod um, Zat's done an amazing job and uh, I'll be swinging by uh, Zat's 
uh, Space Engineers mod IO to uh, throw my appreciation and the link to this video when it goes live uh, in a short while. And you've even got 125 litres of storage in your bins. So, you know, you can chuck uh, things away. And that really is Zat's Kitchen. I'd say it works with the texture system. Let's get some. Um, Eons going on this thing. Really good. Remember this now. It's been a bit since I played around with it. Let's see if I can remember my mate Paul Thompson. Six, five, four, three, two, one. Hash. Yes. Boop. Boop. As you can see, these look really good with this wooden texture. If you want to know how to do that, it's. Uh, down to here to hex and it's six five four three two one and uh, Zat's kitchen is an amazing mod look at that and lots of fun with not only functionality but also design and aesthetics combining these with your actual standard vanilla blocks as well could create some really interesting mess halls, some really interesting base, headquarters, kitchens, and so on. Especially good for roleplay servers, or if you just feel like doing that. And as I said, all of these models do have LOD, level of detail. See. basic stuff but it's cool and it's appreciated thanks for this one zap and uh, that's all for this mod showcase stay tuned there's more coming there's more including as i said i'm going to do a build video on my little escape vehicle my escape rocket that i used for testing flares pulse and torch drives stay tuned for that one stay safe have fun take care Happy engineering. Enjoy the game. There is more to come. We are in the year of war. Bye for now.